Hey guys, this is Spock Joe, and today I'm gonna to be doing something a little bit different. I'm actually gonna be doing an unboxing of a PC that I currently got. Um, it was on a fairly decent deal. Um, I'll talk a little bit more about price point and stuff like that. Uh, me, I'm just uh, trying to get another computer uh, in my house just uh, to help out with my workload and everything like that. And yeah, so we're gonna be looking at this boy right here. We're gonna open it up here in just a second. And uh, with that said, if you guys like this video, please hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And if you wanna see more content like this, hit this channel and the bell. All right, guys, uh, we're gonna crack open this uh, box. We're gonna see exactly what you guys get when you do purchase this CyberPower PC. I did end up getting this at Best Buy. Um, I wanna say the price point was about $13.99, something like that. And uh, yeah, we're, we're gonna see what we can get with this thing. We're gonna pull this thing open. Hopefully I don't rip out this my microphone. Everything's out of the box. We're gonna put that thing down. So just off the off the cuff, we've got a, a lot here, it looks like. Um, we've got this little baggie, and let's see kind of what it looks like. It looks like we've got just some documentation, some dry, CD drivers. Uh, what is this? I think this is for the Wi-Fi. Um, which is interesting that they have fins for that. So, and power cord, a disc um, for, I, I would assume maybe the drivers and stuff for this in case it crashes or anything like that. Uh, what is this? The user manual. Sweet, sweet. Um, we're just going to put this stuff aside for right now. Oh, oh. And this thing comes with RGB lighting and here's the little controller for that so you can actually change your RGB lighting on the fly. So that's pretty cool. We're gonna, I'm gonna seal this up and put this stuff aside for right now before. Um, and then it looks like what? We've got a little mouse here. I'm curious of what this mouse looks like. This is uh, a gaming PC that has a lot that came with it. So here's its, ooh, oh my gosh, that's actually. That actually feels fairly good, which is actually interesting that you would get so much uh, with this. With this. Um, Interesting. So we're, I'm going to put that in here for right. Oh, uh, here, I'll just leave it right there for right now. Put that in the box. Um, also, it looks like it comes with a gaming keyboard. And now I'm just curious if, if this here, I'm going to put this over here. Um, I'm going to open this up real quick. I want to see if it actually is a mechanical. I don't think it is, but it very well might be. Let's kind of open it up. No, it's it's not a mechanical keyboard. It's not a mechanical keyboard. So let's see. That's pretty much what the keyboard looks like. Um, it's a very basic, generic light keyboard that's kind of what I expected from it
All right, so far this is pretty much what you get with the PC. You get a keyboard, a mouse, and this uh, good old PC where we're gonna we're gonna crack open this thing. We're gonna take this out here in a bit, um, but we're gonna take a look and see what this looks like later on after everything is said and done. This thing is put together and everything, and uh, we'll we'll see how it looks. So right, starting off, we've got the RGB fans in here. Uh, it has a little controller that you can actually. Uh, change the lighting in this as well it's kind of cool um, over here you got the RAM and the CPU and we've got the 20 excuse me the 2070 RTX GeForce Nvidia graphics card which is actually really cool because uh, uh, this you know for 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 gaming and uh, different things like that this thing is actually a beast of a graphics card um, it's comparable to the 1080 um, from last generation and uh, let's look around here a little bit more um, I believe the down here is definitely where the uh, power supply is and uh, this thing definitely collects fingerprints just the darkness of it it's crazy um, as we keep on going looking at this this thing is actually the cable management and everything in this is actually really good I, i'm actually really surprised at how clean of a look this has especially for an entry level gaming uh computer especially if you're you're you're, you're just buying it from a, a retailer or something like that and not building it yourself all right guys so this is what you get with this cyber pc computer this this computer that is already pre-built for you guys you can you don't have to worry about going and and trying to build it yourself making mistakes uh along the way but if you are an enthusiast that wants to build your own pc and you want something that is comparable to what uh i ended up purchasing here with this cyber pc um, I, I'm going to give you, I went to Newegg and I just tracked down most of the components and a few components that might be a little bit better than the components that actually came in the PC uh, to give you a price comparison. And you guys probably already know for uh, if you're going to build it yourself, it's going to be cheaper for you than to actually go in um instead of just going to a retailer and buying it outright so um there's some pros and cons to that uh but in the end here it is guys for you If you do like this video, please hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget to uh, just hit me up in the comment section below. If you have a Cyber Power PC, let me know what you think of it. Is it good? Is it bad? Did you have issues? With that said, guys, let me know what you think in the comment section below. And we'll see you in the next one. GG. Peace out.